Hi, this is Deb from Deb's Days Designs, and I'm back today with a spring or summer project. Today we're making these cute flower coasters. These coasters are a great simple way to keep your desktop or tabletop protected while decorating for the summer or springtime. Before I get started, I publish new content frequently, so be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And check out the blog at debsdays.com where you'll find plenty of sewing and crafting projects. It's also where you'll find a link to the written version of this project with step-by-step -step instructions, cutting measurements, photos, and the printable flower templates. And since it's a digital download pattern, you can get started on your very own flower coasters today. I've added a link in the description below this video. All right, let's get this project started. Along with your regular sewing supplies, for this project you'll need fabric, batting, pinking shears, and don't forget the printable template. First, cut out the paper templates, then place a piece of fabric with the right side of the fabric facing down. Place a layer of batting on top. Place another piece of fabric on top with the right side of the fabric facing up. And center a flower template in the stack and pin it in place. Stitch the flowers together by sewing around the outside of the template very close to the edge of the paper. Make sure your needle's in the down position when you're pivoting at those inner points and take your time on those curves. Use pinking shears to trim a quarter inch to half an inch outside the stitching lines. Next, use the circle templates to cut out centers from your fabric scraps. Center the inner circles onto the flowers as desired. And stitch the centers to the flowers by sewing an eighth of an inch to a quarter inch inside the edge of the flower circle. You can also use a zigzag stitch, a blanket stitch, or a satin stitch. And just like that, just that fast, we have these cute flower drink coasters, great for decorating for your spring, summer, or garden party. If you'd like to see more projects like this one, with digital patterns you can print at home, check out the blog at debsdays.com. I've added a link in the description below this video. See you next time with another project.